Hi, I'm Ted, one of the Boat US trailering guys. I'm here to talk about the importance of crossing your safety chains. If they're not crossed, this is what could happen. The trailer tongue would hit the pavement and skid along the ground. That would not be good. Now let's take a look at what it's supposed to look like by crossing the chains. Now we've got the safety chains crossed. This is much better. If the trailer tongue were to become detached from the tow vehicle, the safety chains would actually catch the trailer tongue before it would hit the pavement. Here's how. See how the trailer tongue is suspended by the crossed trailer chains? If the chains hadn't been crossed, this trailer tongue would have been right on the ground. And while we're on the topic of safety chains, make sure that you use an S-hook with a keeper. That way the S-hook stays in place while you're trailing down the road. A standard S-hook does not have a keeper and you run the risk of it coming detached from your tow vehicle. Other type of shackles include this with a barrel fitting and this which screws in just as well. Either of these items are good or better than an S-hook. Remember, keep your trailer chains crossed Keep a safety pin in your coupler and you're good to go. I'll see you in Boat US Trailering Magazine.